If you are running a Google Sites and want to know how many people are actually visiting your page. Today I show you two ways to add a visitor account. One is super simple to add a visible number to your page and the second one to other give you pro level tracking with Google Analytics. First one you can go to any website of course it's not native. Uh, Google site will not give you a native visitor accounts so you need to go to separate or third party uh, or sites who provide this service uh, like this uh, website. Hit a web uh, counter you can select any template of this uh, visitor numbers yeah select anyone like say like this one here if it's one page name you can add the page name here start with account zero and you can have the digits of course uh, if you want to reach to one million whatever uh, you can start with that let's have uh, this one and of course here you have two options of page views or you want unique visitors means like anyone or the same person who visit the website will show you how many times they are visiting even if the same person visit 100 times will show you on that page the 100 times or you want the unique visitors means that person doesn't matter how many uh, visit your website it count only one so we'll generate based on page view we'll get the counter code we'll take the next page and select this code copy it of course i give you a warning not to edit this code because you have the right to, again reserve the right to disable the account of a website so you take it as it is don't amend it don't change anything on this code go to your website go to the input code and paste it here go next and insert here you can see the counter is here you can just change the size maybe move it down and you can go ahead and do the publish you can see it on the live website we will visit the live website and you can see the counter down here so every time a visitor visit this website we count we keep counting these uh, numbers this is one uh, simple way to make uh, visitor accounts and this is visible for the of course who visit your website and for you if you want something more advanced with data analytics and you want to see exactly all the data from the visitors uh, where they are from uh, all this kind of information we need to go to the something called welcome to google analytics you have to create here something called measurement id so we can go with a start measuring here you create your account this account can be for anything like uh, this is you consider it like a main uh, account like i want to know let's say and we go to next here the uh, property id you can just do you can use it as a sub account and under this main account you can have multiple like websites let's say uh, you can select of course the report time zone and even the currency in case of there's something related to this we can change this later anyway under the admin account here you can select of course the industry what kind of industry you have uh, how many you have employees and all that you can so just answer anything hey what is the purpose of your is of course the data you can maybe i want to see the engagement and retention here you can of course accept this uh, and then now is being uh, created for you so what platform you want to start collection of data you can go to the web here where you keep your website name uh, you go to your website here and copy this website name go to analytics paste it here and here you can say uh, stream you can mention maybe my tech site so here you can start creating and continue as you can see that is now the website or the data website is being collected what we actually need from this data the measurement id you can start with a g so you need to copy this one go to your website go to the settings analytics and paste it here so in enable uh, uh, analytics and close this so under your account just close this go to next now data collection is pending because uh, the account is already created but uh, we take about 48 hours 48 hours uh, before actually start collecting your data uh, it takes maybe less than that maybe one hour or two maybe it depends even more so on this home page you can see now uh, all this uh, data available for you you can have the active users uh, event account and new users and key events and you can select by information and now you can see as one active user uh, per minute and uh, even you can select it by the country you can select it by you know all this filter you have of course this uh, tool or this service has so many reports and things you can you do using this tool and this gives you much better information about your visitors so you decide which way 
you like it better or which one serve your uh, of course your website if you have any more questions about this let me know in the comment below i'll try to respond as soon as possible thank you very much for watching and see you in the next one peace